Hello community, I hope you are doing good. In this discussion, we will see how to add event to the POS button. And in case you missed previous discussion about how to add button in the POS, please check link is given in the description. And if you want to learn more about Odoo, you can visit the Weblands channel. Under the playlist, you can see Odoo development. And here you can see Odoo development different playlist available with the different topic wise with the real task assets. You can visit the about page and send your query to this email address source code also available in the github make sure you can follow the branches and we have a different social media pages make sure you can follow to get the latest update so let's back to our main topic like how you can add event to the specific button in the pos screen so let's say we already created a new button here which is the db button right now what we are doing is We are trying to register one click event to this button. All right, so how we can do it? So simple, we are going to here in this WPoS static JS and here. So if you remember last time we created this blank class, right? So now this is the time we can add something inside this class. Okay, so for that, like we have to just inherit the setup method, which is the predefined and we can just call this setup the super call right and now we have to register the click event so here first thing is we have to import here one more library so let's say const use listener require so here like we are using web core utils hook let me add the spelling mistake like this way and here simple we can just use click right and simple we can use here the method name so for that like right now i will use here the method name is like the will be sample button click okay like console dot log hello something like this and this name right this name we have to register here using this dot and the method name we don't need to pass here this brackets all right so like this way that's it and after that like we have to just restart the service all right and let me refresh the screen all right so let me close all the logs here and i will try to click to this button now you can see uh, this is the button click even fast right so like this way you can just add your custom method and you can do your operations here like this way the first thing is the listener you have to import using like this way like at the right in the web module in the core library in the utils there is a hook is available and here we can just try to use inside the setup method the specific event name and here we have to just pass our method name that's it and after that like uh, whatsoever code you write down it will execute all right so if you have any doubt related to this topic please comment below and see you in our next session